Hey everybody, welcome to Black Arrow Gaming. I'm Bob, and I am joined by my little sister Cassie. Hello! And we are going to do a playthrough of Death Road to Canada. Cassie is visiting me at my apartment this weekend, and we've got a uh, shared screen co-op thing going on here. So, I don't know if you guys uh, are familiar with this game or not. It's kind of like a mix of uh, Oregon Trail, or yeah, kind of like a mix of Oregon Trail meets Zombies Survival. It's sort of a top-down um, zombie killer slash story-driven game, so we're just gonna jump right into it. There's not a not a whole lot uh, to say about that, so we're gonna go to a new game. We have already created ourselves. You can actually create yourself or other characters in this game. So I'm gonna be the leader, and Cassie is going to be herself. And you can see uh, I am ultra fit and practical. Um, and Cassie is an explorer and she is calm under fire and she tells people to cool it an awful lot <laughs> um, So yeah, I think everything's fine. We're just gonna do a normal game mode and we'll see how far we can get so We are going to die. Well, we've tried this a few times and it has not gone well So far, I think the best thing we could do is hopefully Cassie doesn't actually switch to the wrong character um, because player two has a tendency to switch between different characters by accident sometimes. Um, so yeah, uh, that's not really a decision, so we're just gonna go with that. So we have to start uh, by picking our first destination, and what are you thinking I'd here? I'd say Yalmart. Probably Yalmart, okay. Yeah, food's always a good, good start, a good thing to go for at the beginning of the game. We're gonna go bargain hunting. Um, Got an umbrella. I started with an umbrella. I've never started with one of those. And I you cut have my mop. You have a mop. That's gonna break like right away. Actually, I think the mop does okay. It kind of keeps people away from long range, uh, but it doesn't do very much damage. And I have no idea how good the umbrella is. There's nothing really else to do here. You can kind of see. You always seem a little distracted. Yeah, I'm distracted, and you oh. are too. Oh no. <laughs> oh, we know a little bit about Cassie. Her shooting's really bad, so. That's not good. Yeah, but uh, I got great composure. She got good composure and, and decent morale, and we don't really know a whole lot about me. I don't know how it determines that stuff, like what we get to know and what we don't, but all right, here we go. All right. So like this, you can see it's like sort of a top-down thing. Um, I'm probably not gonna worry as much about killing these guys out here. I just wanna keep them out of my way. You can also do some fun stuff like, like she just did, picking up shopping carts, throwing them at zombies. It's just a good old zombie killing time. Oh, by the way, if our audio sounds different, it's because we are recording on a mic that's set up on my, like, desk, on, on my uh, desk, my computer desk, so. I brought the fancy stuff with me. Yeah, this is some of Cassie's stuff. Okay, I think there's food down here. Well, actually, yeah, let's grab, oh wait, no, that's not food. That's part of the cash register. Oh, that was ammo. Okay. Got some handgun ammo. Ooh. All right, there's a little food. Oh, a hammer. Okay, that looks a lot more durable. Oh, that's I killed that zombie in one hit with the hammer. Nice. I don't know if... It's probably going to wear you out. Because nothing is ever good in this life. Hammers should be really durable. Oh, good. There's a ton of stuff in here. Uh... You know, I'm gonna switch back to my umbrella because that'll probably break eventually and I kind of want to just get rid of it. Okay. The spine is not bad. Haha, <laughs> box to the face. Oh, there's a piece of wood in there. Do you want to grab that? Oh, uh, no, I'm good. Alright, oh well. This will break in like two hits. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go in here. I'm the only one who can open doors uh, because I'm player one. That also so Cassie... means he can leave me behind and get me trapped by zombies. Yeah, Cassie kind of gets dragged along behind me. Oh, there goes my uh, my wood already. Toilet? Just toilet gas. Oh. Uh, I think this is clear, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go down here. I know there's a door on the right we haven't been in yet. I think that's the last of it. There's like not really a whole lot of food on no. these shelves. I... This is probably another bathroom. Nothing. Yeah, there's nothing in here. You can tell if there's uh, something to pick up because of, like this little sparkles. Is um, there another one? Nope, this is it. Yep, that's oh, all wait. there is here. 
that didn't work. You can see the clock in the top left moving. Um, that is, uh, that shows the current time of day, obviously. Um, the later it gets, the more aggressive and faster zombies get. That's never good for us. Oh. Go, go, go. Zombies will damage your car if you leave it sitting there for, and they hit it. And eventually your car oh, can break. Oh, we got break. one bed. That's not bad. Yeah, we got one in that back room, I think. Uh. Uh. Oh, wow. We already have to make a decision that could have cost us. The group sets up camp outside a grocery store. They notice another group has been following them. We'll probably attempt to loot the place. Maybe me because of my composure? I don't know if that would do it, but... Uh, yeah, we can give it a try. I mean, we're right at the beginning, so it's not like we have a whole lot to lose here. Um... Oh. Cassie says there wasn't any food in there. So Cassie went in but didn't find any food, so our, her morale decreased a Your little bit. Or my decreased. morale did. I'm perfectly fine. Yeah, I don't know. It's like some of these things can have really big consequences. Oh, there might be a dog. <gasps> Apartment a with a bark banner and a pharmacy. A pharmacy could have meds, though. Both of those could be good. What do you think? Well, I mean, my heart says dog. Okay. Yes. Because couldn't possibly go, oh, hey, you've got a handgun at yeah. some point. You oh, can that's put really it away cool. for now. I don't need it. Yeah. That way, if there's something else I can pick up, I don't have to sacrifice my mop. All right. Wait. Oh, we have 29 ammo. Yeah. Pistol uses nine. What does that mean? Pistol uses 90 of 29. We have 29 ammo. I think so. it means that you can have 90 bullets in it at a time. Okay. So, like, you can't go into a map with uh, more than 90 bullets in your gun. Let's go in here real quick. Okay, good. House here already. Nope. There's nothing in here. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll go from the bottom up, I guess. Ooh, oh, yes, yeah. food. All right. A whole bunch of food. That's like two days of food right there for two meals. It was. Hello? Oh, then there's more in here. Oh, yes, another med. That gives us two. So we can basically. It takes two meds to heal an injury, uh. it seems. looking for those little sparkles. Anything we can pick up. Oh, I completely missed. <laughs> so, uh, you can also close doors behind you, which I think is kind of cool. I could do that. And it takes zombies a minute to break through. I can also mess with Bob by opening and shutting them and not allowing Oh gosh, them look out. That guy was like right in my face. Oh, I'm swinging at a dead body. Uh, nothing in here. Whoa, that was weird. Get out of the way. <laughs> hmm. Okay, that apartment... Well, I guess we got a lot of food in there, so that's good. And there goes my umbrella. I'm just down to my hammer. Actually, let's go left. And we'll go from the bottom up. Okay. Make sure we sweep the whole or city. Or we can loop around. Can we even go this way? Yeah, I think we can. Yeah, there's another building here. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh my gosh. I don't have anything. Okay, we'll try to find something for you to use. Punch. Fortunately, this hammer probably Punch. won't break. Ugh. Careful. You're just gonna wear you out. I'm getting tired. I'm ultra fit though, so I can swing stuff around for a while. Uh, you could pick up chairs and throw them still. I know those ones. Forget that. Oh, you can't pick up. Uh, it's an armchair, I guess. Okay, let's go over here. It's 4.05 p.m. Nuts. I might be able to get a piece of wood. Rifle ammo? Okay. Go away. So this one won't break. Is it break it? Get that. Okay. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing in there. Uh, 
let's go here. Nope. nope. <laughs> All out of nothing. Nope. Uh, no. Something. This place. Wait, was there something no, in there? Zombies. That's what I meant. Oh, good, another handgun. Oh, I should have probably let you have that. If you had higher strength, could you pick up like beds and or, like couches and stuff? I don't know. Let's go this way. They're getting mad. Uh, we can't go that way. Uh -oh. we go in between the buildings. There's a fence with that one. I think we have to go back this way. Die. Uh, we still haven't found the dog. We have to find the dog before we go. Assuming there is a dog. Bark, bark. Oh, yes, okay. I just can't believe your stick hasn't broke yet. I'm surprised as well, but I'm not complaining. Completely oh, missing. Oh, there it goes. Okay. <laughs> Punched him to death. Go away. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah. Yikes. Why are there so many coming in right behind I'm us? so tired. Okay. okay. Hello, dog. There he yes. is. Dog seems unusually tame. Most black dogs are still alive and become feral at this point. This dog seems eager to see humans. We will let the dog yeah. follow us. Denise. Ooh, another med. All right. So the dog will help us fight, and they don't take as much food to keep fed, which is really good. Yeah, use those chairs. Oh, and cleaver. Oh, that's a really good weapon. Mm -hmm. And what else is that? A spatula. a spatula? Okay. Yeah, I would just use that until it breaks. This place doesn't seem too bad. Still rooms up here. Uh, something on that shelf. Food. And nothing. Hello? Uh, nothing. Everybody's got their own private bathroom in this house. Oh, I guess this is an apartment. That makes sense. We've been here. Yep. Is there a door on the... Yeah, yes. there's one over here. Then we should probably oh, go back good. to the we car after this. All sorts of ways in and out. Yeah, it's getting really late. Eventually it'll get, like, really hard to see, too. This is a big apartment. Oh, oh, okay. You're still not dead. Oh, geez. Jeez, that guy took a lot of hits. Okay, all right, so we gotta get out of here. It will become very hard to see at night. All right, let's go. I think we got a good enough loot and a friend. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Go! <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Okay, 11 food, that's awesome. Three medical, so we can get yeah, four total. Yeah, we're in pretty good shape. Yes, we want yes, the dog. Yes, we want the dog. All right, so Bob, Cassie, and a little dog. She has a name. They offer eight food in exchange for some help. Uh, hauling and hauling, tilling and planting. I think, uh, the, I'm assuming this will make tired. us tired. Do we want to be tired? Let's repair work. That'll probably reveal my mechanical. Yeah. You can... But for all I know, I could get hurt doing that. Um, we're going to actually say no time to help. We have enough food, and the dog doesn't take as much. We're so. going to regret that later. <laughs> you think so? We always run out of food. Yeah. All right, we'll have me try to repair. There you go. Oh, sweet, that was good. We got food, I got mechanical revealed, which actually increased to, I guess I I'm mediocre. I'm tired now, though. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I'm tired. Which means I'm gonna take- fit, so it's okay. Alarms campsite, oh, okay. Um, camping with strangers is risky, but there's nowhere else to go. Last time we did that, we got robbed. Yeah. You're already tired, so we might as well join you. Yeah, we may as well drive off with no sleep. 
Yeah, I don't want to get robbed. You can get robbed in this game, and it, it really sucks if you do. Um, group finds an old game bronus. It's a handheld video game system that survived this long because it built like a brick. Drobeness cart. Oh. So that would be maybe driving or like you know, I think, mechanical? Uh, I think it will be um, because it's extremely frustrating. It'll be composure, and I have good composure. You think drobeness cart will be good com or for composure? Think, oh, oh, maybe they are different. I'm assuming you play this game and get some sort of skill, but you also become, like, yeah. lose morale or become frustrated. That one might be medical. I don't know what squadron would be. Maybe shooting? So I'm going to assume... You can give me medical so that we've got someone who has a little bit better. Okay. Yeah, I think it... Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. So my, I just, I took a oh, that morale was, that, penalty. That took a significant morale penalty, too, because yeah. you went from positive to rather negative. But I got a medical increase. That's okay. So we're all tired, and Cassie's grumpy. Denise is happy. Okay. Visit trader camp. Let's so see what we got here. At these places, you can trade food for different things. Uh, we do have quite a bit of food. So... Let's see what you have. Health care in exchange for food. We don't need yeah. health care. Denise is a little bit damaged, but... No, that's just... I think dogs just have a max of two. Oh, okay. Uh, right. doesn't want anything from us. And then this will be giving gas for... So, oh, giving 10 gas. units of gas in exchange for every food. Um, nah. Yeah, over. Like you said, we always end up running low on food. Anything down so. here? Sometimes there's a person you can recruit, but I don't nope. know that we want to. No, there doesn't seem to be anything here worth doing. Sometimes these camps have like a house or something you can go loot. So it's always worth checking them out. But most then of the time you don't get that good of deals on them. Then maybe you can get a sturdy machete. The group spies a hitchhiker. He is wearing a hockey mask and standing still alongside the road, statue-like, staring off at nothing in particular. In one hand, he has a chainsaw and the other machete. As the car gets closer, the hitchhiker turns his head slightly to gaze right at the group. Uh, what do we do? I've never seen this before. On the one, if we stop for him, on the one hand, we could get an awesome new companion that we just have to keep feeding. Or we could die. <laughs> 